Hello everyone. Today we're going to take a look at one of my favorite neighborhoods, Flatbush, one of the most diverse and interesting neighborhoods in Brooklyn. Founded way back in 1651 by the Dutch settlers, Flatbush was once of the was one of the many original towns that later joined together to create the borough that we know today as Brooklyn. Though part of a major urban city, the area abounds with homes that have lush front and backyards and many tree-lined streets. Flatbush is famous for its inventory of detached Victorian mansions, one of the largest in the country and primarily located in Ditmas Park. However, its housing stock is much more diverse than that. We have many limestone townhouses in the northwest and in the southeast, mainly a large selection of brick and frame semi-detached colonial and ranch houses, which were built later on starting in the 1940s. Here we are on Chester Court that date back to the early 19th century. The area abounds with other landmarks such as the Flatbush Reformed Church and the Lavish King's Theater, which is also on the Register of National Treasures. My alma mater, Brooklyn College, is also well known. Uh, it's a senior college of New York City's university system and is located at the point which we locals call the junction. As with many New York City neighborhoods, waves of different immigrants have left their distinctive mark and culture on the neighborhood. When I first moved to Brooklyn from London many, many, many moons ago, this one of the, was one of the things that appealed to me most. It has so many different cultures that live here homogeneously together. Although we are in the big city, Flatbush has a very neighborhoodly feel to it. Home prices vary, as you can imagine. Single family homes generally begin around the 550,000 mark. And some of those mansions that are in Ditmas Park go upwards of 1.5 to $3 million. There is also a lot of new construction. So good morning, here we are at Nostrum Health Food and Juice Bar. And we're very honored to have Friday here, Wayne. Wayne, would you tell us a little bit about the business, how long you've been here? So we have the natural food store, the juice bar, and we're here um, for 26 years from 1996. Wow, that's great, because yeah, most businesses yeah. don't last more than five yeah, years. We've gone through some challenging times, including COVID, but we, um, we're here, and we hope we're here to stay to provide for the community and to offer them all the service. Developers have been pill pulling down some of the Victorian homes especially that have a large lot and putting up these multi-complex apartment buildings. It's good to see progress, but some of these buildings have destroyed the unique characters of the neighborhood. Flatbush is a diverse community with many interesting things to do. There is always a new restaurant or bar to check out, plus lots of independent shops and businesses, which adds to the small town feeling. There are houses of worship for all denominations and faiths, and the many public and private schools are readily available and quite decent. We raised our kids at PS 139 and Ditmas Park Junior High School 62. The area is well served by the subway trains, various bus lines, and of course, dollar cabs, a Brooklyn and city phenomenon. Things like this, the fundraiser, we're making sure all of our young people who are graduating get a little gift from this. Uh, we uh, basically, if there's anything that's on the block that's not kosher, we are in touch with the precinct. Um, we do, we check on the elders. We do 
a lot of fundraising to make sure that you know things that we want, which we keep on um, the, the flowers and you have a beautiful block. Yes, thank you, thank you. I understand that the block recently received landmark status. Yes, yes. So we are definitely so that widely used in areas of the two fair zones, so people can get from the train station to their local streets quickly. One of the favorite activities in Brooklyn and Flatbush is just generally hanging out on the block, especially in the hot summer months. We have lots of neighborhood associations that regularly schedule block parties and other activities for the children during the summer months. So what's it like to live in Flatbush? Dynamic and diverse. Flatbush is a melting point, melting pot, and one of the most diverse neighborhoods in the borough of Brooklyn. There is always something good going on and lots of interesting places to eat. Though definitely urban, it has a lot of serene residential areas and outdoor spaces. We are close to some of the major cultural institutions of the borough, Brooklyn Botanic Gardens, the Brooklyn Museum, which is just 10 minutes away. And for intellectual in stimulation, we still have our own King's Theater, which regularly provides shows of top performances. Welcome to Flatbush, a great place to raise a family and a great place to live. Until the next time, see ya.